Macaws are amazing birds. Um, they're probably the largest species of bird that we treat. Um, they come in all different colors. They're beautiful. And the blue and gold macaw is probably the most common macaw that we see, very familiar looking parrot. And then there's the hyacinth macaw, a very royal blue colored macaw, probably the largest macaw that we see. Um, they're, they're fairly rare. And macaws are amazing, but uh, they require a lot of space. Remember, a macaw stretches out and their wingspan is several feet wide. They need to be able to uh, have at least that much space, if not double that space in their cage to be safe at home in a cage and, and protected against banging their wings and damaging their feathers. Um, their beaks are very, very strong. They can actually break bones with their beaks. So you really have to think about whether you have the kind of environment to have a macaw. You know, they can be destructive. Um, they can be very, very loud when they scream. So they're great animals if you have the space and the time. Um, anything else we want to mention about macaw care? I think that um, if you're prepared to have a two-year-old toddler for approximately 30 to 40 years that chews on windowsills and screams really loud, you might be ready to have a macaw. That about sums it up. <laughs> uh, no, macaws are great. Listen, we love them, um, but they're not right for everybody. I mean, with little babies um, or people that are elderly and, and maybe don't move as fast, uh, you know, macaws are big and strong and loud and terrific birds and beautiful birds, but they're not really the best pet for everybody. So you just need to think about it and learn about the macaw before you rush out and get one. Thank you.